The number's right. The number's right, man. So I'm authentic. Who are you? You, you, you. I'm authentic, real name, no gimmicks. What up, people? Man, it's authentic, Benny, and I'm back with another video, man. And today, it's just started raining, man. I know y'all hear that, you know. <laughs> Raindrops hitting the ground, man. What a day, what a day. I was gonna go get y'all some close-up footage of the 300 and everything, but I guess y'all just gonna have to see from afar. Uh, y'all saw the title, y'all saw the thumbnail, and it ain't no joke. I know I made a video before this, like hitting around that, you know, my 300 had to go and all that. But today is actually the day, man. We about to go ahead and uh, take this thing over to Tiger Honda. They got, they wanna look at the car. They want to buy the car, you know, I just put it out there online and uh, they want me to bring it through so they can get the appraisal done. So uh, we're going to see what's up, man. This might be the last day that we got the Chrysler 300, depending on the price, you know what I'm saying? So I don't know, man. We're going to see. But first off, let's check the kicks out, man. Got the Jordan 1s on today, you know, the wheat things, you know. But uh, as we come over here. We see we came a semi-long way with it. All we did, really, I only had this car a couple months, man. But we tinted the tail lights, blacked all this out, blacked all this out in the same tint. You probably can't tell by the raindrops, but it's like a metallic finished tint. You know, uh, put the ceramic tint all the way around, 20 on the sides, 20 on the back. Put, uh, I blacked this out. Wrap this myself. Uh, this is Avery Dennison, I believe it is. Uh, just gloss black, just to black everything out to make it look like a full glass roof. I thought that was a nice touch. Um, put the wheels on that we had on the scat pack, and pretty that's pretty much what we did. And we got the uh, CCI caliper covers. Shout out to them, man. They sent me them. Uh, you know to put on the car, made them specifically for this car. Got authentic written in there in the orange, you know. Um, I will be taking these wheels off before we sell a car. So anybody interested in buying these wheels, uh, you know, just get at me, DM on Instagram because I can't do nothing with them. They cannot fit on my Dodge Challenger. So, like I said, if you if you interested, hit me up. They fit charges, 300s, slim body challenges, anything like that. So just hit me up if you're interested in these. If you think they'll look good on your whip, they are the Brush Stainless SF03s and the 22s. So uh, 22 by 11 on back, 22 by 9 on the front. So just hit me up. If you want to get these, as far as the inside, I ain't changed nothing in the inside, so it ain't nothing really, uh, it's nothing really to take off this car, really. See, inside is like plain Jane, you know. I, uh, it's a shame, but once I got the scat, I kind of stopped minding it when I should have. Oh, another thing I added was the springs. I got some springs for the scat. And I just decided to put them on the 300 because the wheel gap on the 300 was crazy. And as you can see right here, ain't no wheel gap, baby. And I love the ride of this. This thing feel like it just glued to the road. I love the feel of it. But like I was saying, in the inside, nothing really changed. Y'all already know. I got that uh, panoramic sunroof. It's going to stop halfway. And then boom, take that thing all the way back because we about to take this car right now. As y'all can see, that thing open up real, real bright. And um, I mean, like I said, everything else is stock. I already got one uh, appraisal and I'm about to go get the second appraisal. And maybe later on, we're gonna go to CarMax just to get a third one so I can get the 
the best price possible for this car. So with that being said, man, make sure y'all follow the Instagram. You know, authenticated is the car page. Authentic Ben is the personal page. Um, I see y'all when we get to the place. Man, I'm chilling. What's good with y'all? Yeah, man. About to uh, get this thing appraised, man. Man, you trying to sell it, bro? Yeah. Why you trying to get rid of it? Tesla time, man. Tesla? Oh, <laughs> yeah. yeah. All right, man. Look at this type of all thing right here. Pressure, pressure, pressure. Ooh. Should I get one of these? Yes, yeah, sir. Should I get one of these, man? They got the carbon fiber at the bottom. It's like a satin carbon fiber. It ain't really. I do YouTube too, by the way. <laughs> yeah. I like that. That's that type of? Yeah. Continentals. 36 red seats. Ooh, they got the red Alcantara. I like that. Stick shift though. Can't do nothing with it. Alright, man. Just got the car done. He uh looked at it and everything, offered me a price that I'm not gonna take at all. Y'all ain't gonna believe this price I got offered. But uh that ain't gonna happen like that. So this is the price that I was offered right here. Y'all see it right here, man. For a 2019 Chrysler 300, 19.5. That is crazy. Nissan offered, what, 23? 23, 23, 23.7 or something like that. And that's like the highest offer we got for the car right now. So, um, I don't know. Next stop is uh, CarMax. I don't know, but we'll see. So man, we over here at CarMax right now, you know. Um, about to see what they got, about to see what they could do for us. I don't know, man. It seemed like everybody trying to haggle the price, even though they know that they can sell this car. Three hundreds are still selling. I don't know why they coming with that uh that haggling, but I'm not it, it ain't like the good thing is, it's not like I'm in a rush to sell a car, so I can I'm in a position where I can wait on the best deal. So I don't know, man. We're gonna see what uh what CarMax got to offer, and we're gonna go from there. Like I said, man, this is a brand new car. Like the leathers is perfect with the white piping. You know what I'm saying? Got the panoramic sunroof, man. How dope is that? And low mileage. So I'm not gonna just take anything because I know this is a good car. You know what I'm saying? I know what it's worth. So. We gonna see, man. We gonna see what they say. So here we go, man. Got them checking the car out. We gonna see what we got. I don't know, man. It's gonna be sad to see her gone, man. For real. For real, for real. That old authentic thing about to be leaving me, man. Golly, but it's for the better good, man. Wait till y'all see what's coming next, though. It's gonna be pressure. All right, so I just got one of the uh, service reps to look at the car, as you saw. You know, took all my information down. I told him that I want to keep the wheels that's on my car. So if you're looking to buy these wheels, man, hit my DM right now. You know, I, uh, if you want to get them local, it's going to be a certain price. But if you want to ship them, that's a completely different thing, man. It costs an arm and a leg to ship these things. So uh, just know that. Right now, we waiting on... He said we're waiting on the buyers to come out. When the buyers come out, look at the car. You know, they're going to look at the engine, look at uh, the interior, look at everything. You know what I'm saying? Check out the sunroof and everything. They're going to look at everything that got to do with the car and uh, pretty much work up a number, work up a deal, and um, see if we can go from there. So, I'll, uh, I don't know. I'll wake y'all back up when they come out. All right, man. So, this is crazy during this pandemic. He asked me to open everything up. So I opened all my doors up. You know what I'm saying? Raise the hood. As y'all can see that big V8 thing. Hey bro, the 300 ain't no now. Nah. Don't don't think the 300 is 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 sleeping or nothing like that. It's yet alive. But he asked me to open everything up. He ain't touched nothing in my car. He just looked from the outside. But he had to look in the trunk. 
looking everything, so I'm closing everything up right now. He ain't touched nothing in here. They don't test drive until they buy the car or nothing. So, what we gotta do right now is, right now I'm just waiting. Uh, he gonna get the appraiser together, you know what I'm saying, print that up, and then he gonna come back and uh, you know, give me the numbers, everything that we looking at so we can see what it's hitting for. Um, so, pretty much, it's just a waiting game right now. But the, I guess he gonna print the paperwork out, see what he come with. He said he couldn't give me the numbers of my car uh, with the factory wheels on, only as I bought it. So that number will be selling the car with my wheels on. He said, in order for me to get the number with the factory uh, rims and tires, I have to bring it like that. So I don't know, man, I might be selling the car with the wheels, which I don't want to do. But if the number's right, the number's right, man. So I guess we'll see. So the wheels might be for sale. And then they might not be for sale. I don't know, man. But regardless to whatever happened today, I'm going to take these wheels off my car today before I get another appraisal because I'm not playing no games with them, man. But uh, I don't know, man. We'll see whenever they get back, man. We'll see. We'll see. Cross fingers, man. All right, man. The appraisal is complete, man. Complete. Uh, once again, it's not what I was looking for. I'm gonna go ahead and give y'all the numbers right now. All right, so this is what it is, man, for my 2019 Chrysler 300S, man, with a panoramic sunroof, with 22-inch wheels on it, man, even though you're probably not giving me the money that I need for that, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's crazy. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and take the wheels off and, you know, hopefully try this thing again i also got another offer coming in from a place that i can't say right now because that's gonna give away my next move so uh i'm gonna tell y'all right now that offer ain't come in yet but i'm gonna tell y'all right now what we got we got the first offer is like maybe 23 second offer as you as you saw is like 19.5 or something like that which is ridiculous and then the third offer is 20 racks 20 racks flat so uh i don't know man we're gonna see we're gonna see how this thing go of course i'm gonna go with the higher number which is 23 something 23 7 i think it was so uh we gonna try i'm gonna go there with my factory wheels and everything and we're gonna try to up that price up but that's gonna be for another video uh got three uh appraisals so far one still coming in from this let's just say big company and we're gonna see what they coming with but uh that's gonna wrap this thing up for now you know what i'm saying make sure y'all follow the instagram authentic business oh that car almost hit the other car i hate when people swing so close to a car man that's why i park way back here by myself but getting back on track make sure you follow the instagram man authentic ben is the personal page authenticated is the car page and authentic that frenchies is the dog page man make sure you follow all three three completely different sets of content man until next video authentic benny i'm out i want to tell y'all about something that's real real dope you know about this i am 29 jump starter power bank from my amazing man this thing is so dope so cold anybody ever been on side of the road not knowing you know what i'm saying you gotta flag somebody to, to to jump you off you gotta flag somebody down to get them to help it's a stranger you don't know who this person is man this is the most unsafe thing ever to do especially if you got kids you know elderly people whatever you don't want just a stranger coming up on your car man so you got to keep one of these in your car make sure you keep one of these in your scat pack make sure you keep one of these in any vehicle you got man i told them i need one for every car for real man you never know what i happen you never know and this will get you out of any situation man jump start your car get it right and that ain't it man all you gotta do is go on amazon and use my code authentic man i'm gonna put it right here authentic man all caps this will get you 20 percent off man 20 percent off the jump starter man all you gotta do is go on amazon go to checkout and then enter the code authentic man for 20 percent off this jump starter you know you can charge three devices at a time you see, i know you see that little flashlight and you know 
jump your whole car off without needing the help from nobody, especially with this corona thing going around. You don't want nobody around you anyway, so you can be solo, dolo, by yourself, get it done. Um, like I said, use the code AUTHENTIC in all caps to get 20% off and yeah man get it done i will be doing a full video on this thing man full video coming soon letting y'all know how it's done i'll take my whole battery out my car and use this alone to jump these cars and you know these scat packs these big bodies they take a whole lot of power to start this little device will get it done you know so uh y'all make sure y'all stay tuned for that video it is coming soon and um yeah like i said go get yours Amazon, the link is in the description below. The link is in the description below for your jump starter, man. Once again, the code is authentic to get 20% off, man. Back to the video.